Hello again. Welcome to what I think is episode 162 of Dub Life, perhaps. I think so. I think 161 was last week in SeaWorld. <clears throat> and welcome. I am actually in Victoria's house, as you can see. This is not a toy room that you are used to seeing, although you've seen it a time or two, if you've been watching Dub Life for a while. Uh, but we are at Victoria's house. Um, we stayed here last night, um, yesterday morning, let's see, when we last left you at Dub Life, it was Tuesday night, we were at the lights at SeaWorld, uh, we had just seen the rap battle that suddenly broke out, uh, Kai had s'mores, that was about 36 hours ago from where we are now, <clears throat> then we were down in Florida, and Wednesday morning, yesterday morning, uh, we drove back home. Uh, we went to kickboxing and karate. Uh, Natalie had to work a little uh, yesterday, and then we drove here a couple more hours. Uh, so and we were in the car about, I don't know, I think Natalie said she drove like 16 hours yesterday or something like that. It was a lot. Busy day. We came here, and uh, so today, Thanksgiving Day, uh, we can go uh, to our parents' house and enjoy time with the family for Thanksgiving. So, happy Thanksgiving to all of you, even though as you're watching this, it is a good distance away from Thanksgiving, I think. Uh, I think the week of Thanksgiving, you will be watching uh, Us Go See Ghostbusters, and then the next week will be the SeaWorld episode, and you'll be here. So, it's like two weeks ago for you. Gotten a little bit ahead, which I tend to do sometimes when we have a lot of stuff like this going on. And uh, one thing, I just want to start this video, uh, I was watching OG Geek. Uh, Mike's Instagram the other day and uh, he was doing a ask me anything or whatever like where you can put questions on Instagram and he would answer them and uh, one of the things that somebody asked him was who he thought made the best videos and he went through all of his friends and just talked about what made their videos unique and uh, when he was talking about me he talked about all the different things that make my video unique and how in in one channel you can get toys or you can get health and fitness or motivation or lifestyle or whatever. Um, and first of all, thank you, Mike. That was very kind. A lot of things he said and it, it made, it, made us feel good. Uh, but I did think about that um, and think about this whole YouTube thing here at, you know, over three years of every Sunday putting out this episode. And I don't know, the my channel, my channel's age is like 10 years because I would post random things to YouTube early days of YouTube, but it would just be like, what is now like shorts, or TikTok, maybe just really quick clips of things I thought was funny. I've deleted all that. Uh, probably about four years in totality since I've been posting things. Uh, somewhere around there, coming up on that. I thought about, you know, I have been pretty consistent. I'm proud of that. And I've, I've dabbled in a bunch of different things uh, outside of Dub Life. And, um, but most of my friends that kind of inspired me to start YouTube. Uh, don't post anymore, post very irregularly. Um, I, I can remember both Josh and Cody Foxy for real were kind of the first people I was watching and, and thought, hey, I could do that. And, um, you know, both of them, I mean, Josh got married, Cody's got married, he has a, has a child, kids growing up, life happens in it. And they, uh, you know, they don't, they don't post as much anymore because they have better priorities, honestly, than, than posting to YouTube. And I'm happy for those guys. I'm proud of those guys. Um, OG Geek, he doesn't post uh, quite as much as he used to. And he admits that himself. Uh, you know, he's very irregular with his videos. Um, you know, uh, I watched a lot of talk art in the early days. I still, in, I enjoy Rob and I think he's funny. Um, and, and he posts a lot more recently, but it's similar when, you know, in different relationship, things happen, you don't post as much. Um, you know, of course we got Seth, the hardest working man on YouTube who posts 27 times a week. Uh, and he just grinds it out. Uh, but I just was thinking about that. I'm like, well, why have I continued to do this when several times I've thought about stopping as I've been very open on the channel or slowing down, uh, when, you know, most of my friends do that and I'm certainly not financial. Uh, motivation, you know, there's not the the three dollars or something that I might get off a of YouTube video. Is has no, you know, I certainly spend more than that to make them. Uh, but uh, you know, why do I keep doing it? And I thought about the history of my channel and started off with just being very generic toy hunts with music over the top, uh, and that was because uh, you know I saw what everybody was doing, and most people were just going in the same WalMarts and Targets and Walgreens over and over again. 
And at the time I was traveling for work and I was like, well, I go into all these really cool toy stores. I can show people something that's not just the same Walmart section that they have over and over again. So I started doing that, but I would be embarrassed or uncomfortable to talk over the top or I didn't want to disrupt the environment of the store or whatever. And uh, so I just have music over the top. And that's not what people want. Like they want to hear you talk. They want to hear your commentary that they're there for you. They're not there to see the same, you know, uh, Spider-Man Marvel legend that everybody shows. They're there to hear your commentary on it and hear what you say. And that's how it started. I did some drone stuff. I think I did a technology review. Um, I tried to do some reviews of some toys. Yeah, you know, I was just floundering about just trying some different things out. And, uh, and then I decided that I wanted to turn it more into a vlog style where I talk and, and kind of show everything I did. Um, and that was the first evolution when Dub Life started. And then Dub Life itself has evolved where it started as primarily travel vlog and toy stores. And that's it. And then it evolved into a version of Jackass kind of where all my various friends would join and uh, often do silly things, stupid things, ride a horse, eat something weird, whatever, for a prize. Uh, and then, you know, it became more familial where my family members started to be involved and, um, you know, share whatever. And we tried to do motivational stuff. And then it became a lot more family centered. And then, uh, you know, as the pandemic started, it became very health and fitness and, and mental, um, you know, to kind of help push through 2020. And then certainly now um, that Natalie and I have been together for about a year now, um, it's been very uh, home videos, you know, to be honest with you. Um, and all the elements of the previous things are there. There's still toys sometimes, unboxings. Every once in a while we'll review, at least talk about a toy a little bit, especially if Kai wants to do it. Um, there's lots of family stuff. There's lots of uh, health and fitness. There's a little bit of everything. Uh, and, uh, you know, ultimately... Uh, long videos every week uh, and you know I think I do it because it's memories that that I like for us to be able to have one day um, and watch back and so many things that my friends and I we talk about from from a decade ago we have no way to relive them other than just think about them which is great I mean memories are very important uh, but some of that stuff we wish we had videos or pictures of that were accessible they're locked away on a phone that long since has died and we can't find a charger for and whatever uh, so I tell you all that to say, you know, I don't know how much longer dub life goes. Um, but I know the girls enjoy it and we get to do a lot of stuff and, uh, it's going to look a lot like, you know, the, the, the vlog was last week with SeaWorld and they really a family vacation. And sometimes it'll be really heavy toys. Like some of these unboxings have been when we get a big bad toy store thing. And, um, and then of course it'll be antics with my friends when uh, we all get together, uh, which we're trying to do a lot more of recently uh you know in the past year we've done a lot of conventions a lot of that stuff so i hope you enjoyed that blog please leave in the comments you know what you'd like to see more of what type can't tell you that that's what we're going to do but i do appreciate the feedback uh because sometimes you know in a week like this where over a seven day period we'll probably make three episodes because we had the ghostbusters weekend with victoria and victoria came to visit and usually when victoria comes to visit i film an episode and then we went out of town to Orlando, and usually if I'm going out of town somewhere, I'm going to film an episode. And now we're out of town a different place, and it's a holiday, and usually then I'm going to film an episode. So three episodes in a short period of time. Um, you know, do you like seeing the various things? I know some people just want to see the Walmarts, and that's not what we're going to do. Um, uh, and the length of the videos, I still, almost every week, I'm over an hour. There's very few of my videos that haven't gone an hour in Dub Life. Uh, is that what you're looking for? Would you rather have just short weekly vlogs that are like 10 or 12 minutes once a week or whatever? I'm just curious for some feedback. Um, I know a lot of my friends like the long videos. They like the, to watch them when they're in their car, when they're working. And ultimately, my um, biggest audience is my family and friends and care what they think. Anyway, it is Thanksgiving. Uh, we're going to continue to get ready and uh, get ready to head over to mom and dad's and uh, have a feast that we've all earned after a, a, another challenging year in 2021. Um, it's, it's felt very long, even longer than 2020. Uh, so we're excited for that. Um, then there'll be Black Friday. I don't know what we'll do. Uh, there's the Top Dog Comics that I, I've gone to a, a several times when I'm here. They recently moved locations to a bigger location. like, And they just had Jason David Frank there signing. 
recently. So I'd like to go visit that store if they're open uh, for Black Friday. Uh, and then we may see what else, what else we get into. I know Victoria sometimes likes to go Black Friday shopping. So we'll see. Um, and uh, then we'll go from there. Uh, I think everything at home, there's nothing to unbox. Everything is clean at the house. Remember, we left the house clean. Uh, did all of our organizing several episodes ago before we left for Orlando. It's not much to show you there, but I will show you around Victoria's house uh, right now. And we'll start here in her office collecting room. Show you down the steps first before I go back in there. And you see she has, I think you saw Natalie hung these. These are the Pesk effects, the Harry Potter uh, kind of metallic art. One for each movie, which is really cool. Uh, so guest rooms, guest bathrooms, that's Victoria's room. Come in here into her office, toy room, workout area. So I'll just go you around, show you everything. There's her Stephen Amell and Buffy stuff. Uh, shout out to Chris James who gave Victoria these Power Rangers McDonald's toys. Something she really enjoyed. Some Marriott carpet. Come over here, some more art. That Daryl Dixon that we got at uh, Joe Fest here in Augusta, I think. Doctor and Rose, Game of Thrones concert. There's a, a 3D changing Mario, Peach, and Bowser, I think, right? Yeah. That uh, Harry Potter Wizards. Over here, a lot of her pictures from when she's met various celebrities. Tom Felton. Uh, so Harry Potter people, that's the guy from Heroes, I cannot pronounce his name. John Barrowman for Doctor Who, Tom Felton again, David Tennant for Doctor Who, the Weasleys, Jamie Lannister, uh, that's Ezekiel, for, and uh, Cooper Andrews from Walking Dead. You see a Baby Yoda, that's from Bomba's Art, and Todoroki, Deku and Bakugo, All Might, some really nice art. And you've seen us pick most of this stuff up this year, and some of her... Graded comics, some other people that we've met at conventions, and more art. Again, very neatly displayed. I like the way she has it all, and then kind of her pops and figures and various things. Harry Potter, primarily Harry Potter and uh, Baby Yoda. Some Winnie the Pooh stuff back there, you see. Baymax. There's Baymax. So the new Baymax series is coming. That's very exciting. Stranger Things. There's a uh, Hot for Hopper with the little hopper. Oh, stand up, buddy. Oh, he's a challenge. Yeah, I want to stand up. There you go. Daredevil. Is that Aquaman, I think? Yeah. In sync figures. A lot of good stuff. Displayed very nice and clean, presented well. Then our exercise bike, I know she works out in here as well. So we like that, we think it looks great. Oh, down here, more art. I think those are the Funko Five Stars and various Harry Potter books and what have you. Downstairs now, Victoria's Christmas tree. Isn't that lovely? Yes. That is a lovely. Ty is building Lego. What set are you building? I'm building the, the, the Friends. The Friends apartment. Now oh, you've gotten a lot done. Ooh, the famous ball. Yes. There's this. The recliner's actually Look at on. this. They recline. That's Will awesome. Pig, is that the glass guy's name? Yes, that's his name. We'll get this up today. That will make her happy. Where is that going to live? In my room. Oh. Is that tree like your Christmas tree? Uh, kind of. It's similar. <laughs> Yeah, and I have ordered something to go on that wall now. I'm just waiting for it to come in. Is it the platform for the Hot Toys Baby Yoda right there? No. Oh. Baby Yoda. There's, you can see the Harry Potter stuff going up the stairs. Victoria's Hop for Hopper. <laughs> Some of her art and My Hero and Lego. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. And a basket of uh, throws. Yeah, you know. And dueling robot. Yes, I had Where's to move the them one? so they wouldn't fight. Over there in that corner. Because they, they've had a duel before? Yeah, when they were both over here, it's like the, the Wi-Fi was interacting with it, and they would like run into each other continuously. Oh, uh, well. <laughs> crap bag. So that's an update on Victoria's house. Looks great. Finally has all her furniture in. I'm sorry. I believe. Mm -hmm. Thank I believe she finally has all her furniture in. They're uh, deciding what stickers to put on the whiteboard. And she went with the feces one. I'm sorry. I'm sorry one. 
All right, well, we're gonna continue to get ready and next stop, hopefully, Thanksgiving lunch. I'll be able to eat a lot of it. That cheese then, thing? Yeah, and then I'll still have room later because we're not eating it all together. Are you just so gonna pick that up and eat it like a sandwich? I mean, honestly. You. Well, no, you want the jelly. Oh. So, peanut butter jelly sandwich? No. Oh, Kaya. Look at all that turkey. Yeah. Are you gonna eat rolls? Yes. Potatoes? Yes. Why does it keep happening to me? Sweet okay. yam, sweet potato souffle with nuts and all that. <laughs> Stuffing. Yes. Green beans. Be Macaroni cheese. Yes. Cranberries. Yes. Gravies. Yes. All of it. I try. All right. Well, it's all here. I think the mm. mac and cheese is for you. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. K for Kaya. On there. K for Kaya. Sometimes it's nice to be barefoot and let feet go. But my wife. Sometimes it's nice to be barefoot and let your feet go. Well. That sounds like has a big plate. I do. There is controversy. Nala has a big plate. Like some people mm, think it's really good. Gravy. Say happy Thanksgiving hot chicken. Happy, happy Thanksgiving. Turkey. I think you're missing that chicken. Oh, it's a video. Big pie. Uh, Are you going to have pie? Know. You have peanut butter pie? Mm -hmm. That's no sugar. Just Yummy. <laughs> What's in your hand? <laughs> My cheese. Oh, no. What's happening? <laughs> well, now we're going to engage in the uh, wonderful Thanksgiving tradition of watching a martial arts movie with the best martial arts movie ever. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles is excited. Me! Yay! Everybody left the room. Everybody else oh. fled. I don't know what's wrong with Victoria. She must have had diarrhea. Yeah, you had diarrhea? No. Oh. We have returned back to Victoria's house after a wonderful day of Thanksgiving uh, food and festivities with mom and dad. And we watched Ninja Turtles as well as football and just hung out and spent time with the family. I don't think I filmed the whole lot, actually, just a, maybe a couple clips of food. We watched the movie and again, just uh, trying to spend time with the family and not necessarily do everything on camera. So we're back at Victoria's house. I think everybody's pretty wiped out, food coma style. Um, Kaya enjoyed Ninja Turtles. So that was good. Uh, she wants to watch the other, the next one, uh, which we'll watch at some point soon. Uh, I don't know that we're doing anything else tonight though. So probably we'll pick back up tomorrow, which is Black Friday. And uh, this video will probably be scattered around over the next few days of things we're doing. So uh, let's find out what tomorrow dub has got up his sleeve. Probably gravy. Good morning, good morning. Happy Black Friday or two and a half weeks later as it may be for you morning. Uh, we ended up staying up a little bit and we watched the first two episodes of Hawkeye on Disney Plus last night and we enjoyed them. They're kind of slow, um, much more grounded. Uh, they honestly, they feel like the Disney Plus version of the Netflix shows. Not quite as dark, um, or violent or language driven as the Netflix shows like Daredevil, Punisher and such. Uh, but that type, much smaller scale, city based, um, seem to be following, uh, or at least adapting a story from the Fra Matt Fraction Hawkeye run, which I know is my sister Kimberly's favorite run. Certainly using the art style, the logos, uh, like Pizza Dog and the Tracksuit Mafia and all them. That's all uh, Matt Fraction inspired. Uh, so if you uh, like this, go read that comic run because it's, uh, it's renowned. It's very, very popular. Uh, from about 10 years ago, maybe? Something like that. And... Uh, Anyway, I'm on the way to pick us up some breakfast, lunch, something. It's 10.20. Uh, and, you know, we didn't go any Black Friday last night. Now, I did do some online Black Friday. I bought some stuff from Under Armour uh, and then some other stuff, some Christmas presents uh, for myself and the girls. Uh, workout stuff, you know, as we... Uh, December 1st starts my new year, the way I do it. Uh, it'll be the third year in a row doing that. And uh, so, you know, I try to get myself some new threads as I start a new set of goals to chase after, uh, which is really gonna be uh, sculpting, believe it or not. Um, year one was about just losing as much weight as I could. Year two was about bulking back up some of that. Obviously some of that I bulked up too much. Uh, you know, I put on a good bit of muscle, but with that came some fat that I don't like. Um, and so now I want to sculpt it, lean part of that out, sculpt it. I'm right near where I want to be in terms of weight. You know, I can, I can stand to lose a little bit more, but not much more. And uh, I want to sculpt it. I want to have definition. And I've been working on that at the latter half of the year. 
Uh, but now that I have some muscles that are functional, I can do jump kicks and I'm faster and, and such. Um, I want to sculpt those out. That's probably going to be the next year's goal. I got to figure out how to quantify that. It's a little hard, but uh, we'll talk more about that in the future. And uh, so anyway, uh, you know, it's a little bittersweet. You know, uh, I don't, uh, my dad was saying last night that uh, Black Friday is one of the things that the internet has kind of taken away from us, us meaning just people, because uh, you don't need to go anywhere. You, all the sales are online all week. You can get whatever you want that way. You don't have to go wait in line for five hours to do anything. Uh, and there's certainly a great deal of positives about that. Um, I never have had to work in retail in my life, but I know a number of my friends have and still do. Um, many of you probably do. And, and this time of year is just a, a burden for you. It stinks. You got to work extra hours. You can't be with your friends and family on the holidays. You can't get time off. Uh, and customers are just rude and butts. And... Uh, that sucks. So I'm, I'm grateful that more and more people that at least I know don't have to work uh, Thanksgiving Day and, and so forth. Um, but the other side of that is like there's memories that go away for uh, for some people. So like Steve and I used to every year as part of our tradition, we go late, you know, like midnight Black Friday shopping and go uh, find some things and do whatever. And uh, we have a lot of great memories of that. It's just kind of a tradition. And we were never the people that were being mean. We tried to be extra nice to people and kind and tip generously at restaurants and so forth and try to kind of swing it the other way. Um, and, you know, that doesn't really happen anymore, um, especially with, you know, both having families and kids and such. It, it makes it even harder to see each other on the holidays, which is, which is a sadness. But uh, we, you know, it's a good thing. It's a good thing. So... You know, there's just, a, it's kind of give and take, right? It's kind of give and take. And uh, so I, saying all that, um, it is Black Friday today. We are still going to be in town here. I'll probably go see my parents again, spend some more time with Victoria before we go back home. And what I don't know is if we will actually go in anywhere. Victoria does have a Walmart near her and a GameStop near her. We may swing in those. I do want to go to the comic store I was telling about because I haven't been in there since they remodeled. I'm sure they're open today. Uh, but I'm not really looking for anything either. That's part of the challenge. There's just nothing that I have in mind that I need, uh, which is a great blessing. Another thing we were talking about with my family last night, my parents, people trying to make their Christmas list, and there's nothing we need, nothing we want. We're very blessed. Um, the Lord's been good to us, and, you know, when you're at a place where there's nothing you need, nothing you want, that's a good thing. And, you know, people want to give you gifts and stuff, so you try to be creative and figure that out, but we're at a good place. And, uh, and so a lot of functional stuff, workout clothes, um, you know, protein bars, stuff like that are on the wish list. Things you're going to buy anyway. Um, you know, maybe a few toys here and there. So I don't know what we'd go shopping for. Uh, maybe just kind of go do it. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think anybody needs anything. So we'll see. But I am here. Right over there is a Chick-fil-A. So I'm going to go through the drive through pick up some chicken for everybody. And uh, we'll see where this day goes. Uh, I do know I had a package delivered at home today, so we'll look at that when we get home. I'm excited for that one. Probably open that up and look at it, um, and then we'll see what else we do. It's a, just a Friday, um, and we've got the weekend off too, so I don't know how long this video will go. I know we haven't done much so far, so we'll find something creative and fun to do. And in the meantime, uh, chicken time, rub it. Huge sack. I always come back with way too much. It's a, it's a blessing and a curse. Huge sack of chicken. Next. Look at all this chicken. You got chicken. Egg whites. No, oh, that's not what's popping. Well, now we're on this. Same thing's never changed. Joe Exotic Part 2. Oh. Okay. This one Merch drop. Oh, oh, are you gonna purchase that product? No. Oh, it would be the greatest thing. The greatest they keep showing these clips of people acting like they're Joe Exotic. I need Corin Steve to be on this. It, it would be the greatest thing that could ever happen. Always, Victoria oh, sprung up from Joe Exotic to get the Lego yeah. shirt. What's it's that? the oh, stick! Oh, to 
poke the man. We did that. Oh, like Remember the, the cat time? that jumps on? Yes. When they're on the balcony. Yes. That's a big set. Do you like that? Yes, it's wonderful. Do you think this is better than Joe Exotic so far? Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. Got that thing hung up for Victoria and Natalie did. That looks so good with the glass. And that's one piece of paper that they cut into this, which is really, really cool. Picked this up at Dragon Con. Really neat. We fast forwarded. We're at the GameStop. And uh, seeing what's gonna happen. Maybe, except that gentleman's not going inside. No, well, maybe we are. Oh, it's a trick. It's a trick. That means no PS5's available. <laughs> this door will not have any. Yeah, you know. I'm just gonna see what else they're working with. Like the Tom Nook stocking that Victoria immediately wants. Oh, oh, look, I... My Hero Academia 15 Days of Socks Advent Calendar. What's this now? <laughs> <laughs> That's... You You're keeping than... it a mystery. That's a little pricey for my... Uh... <laughs> You pay. Reference. It's like 75 cents a sock. It's not bad. A dollar 25. I, I wear very expensive, nice socks. Oh, I will actually Bombas. Soundwave with tapes. What about this? The demon. You want that, the demon? Oh, Victoria's looking at the pink Power Ranger. Oh, EB snapback. Okay. None of this really looks terribly Black Friday. Where's the brochure? Maybe there's not a brochure. Huh? Xbox? You can get Red Dead Redemption 2 for $19. Paw Patrol Mighty Pups for $2.99. Okay. You good on that one? What about these uh, Marvel Legends? Psycho Man. Fear, Doubt, and Hate. Broken Red Skull. Quicksilver back there. What else? Mr. Hyde. Sprite. Hopper, Hopper, Modoc. Cheeks. Let's see. Uh, nothing terribly uh, interesting. Mandalorian. All the shirts nine dollars. Naked Goku. Oh. You don't want that? Oh dear. Kai came running. Goku. For the Naked Goku. Spirit Bomb Goku. Master Roshi. Hmm. I don't know why that is. That's creepy. Uh oh. Hmm. All right. I don't think there's anything here. Well, that was like going just regular to GameStop every other day. I don't, there was like no promotions. Although maybe things are just marked now. Yeah, see, Victoria didn't buy. Kaya wanted Victoria to buy Dang and Run Fun. Oh, Victoria didn't buy that. What? No. Dang and Run Fun? Yeah, I don't know. That kind of sounds like profanity. Uh, but we're going to stop in the Walmart just I don't know, to do something. To see if they have anything for Black Friday. Do you think they're going to have anything, Kaya? Kaya left. She dipped. Dang and Run Fun. They got Mr. Christmas since 1933. Super Motorcycle Santa. Do you want the He-Man and oh, is this Skeletor like a Hallmark? ornament? Skeletor? Oh, we got Walmart. Is that an 11 right there? Yeah. 11? Yeah, with a waffle. Darth Vader. Mandalorian. Sonic. Demogorgon. Oh, Kai's favorite. Oh, the Central Perk Cafe Couch. Victoria. Oh. There's a Hogwarts crust. Huh. Like I've ever, there's a lot of Harry Potter. Rachel. Rachel. They also have mystery box Harry Mario. Potter ornaments. Oh, you're gonna get that? No. Thing. Lopes. Oh, yeah. Walmart. What? Huh. 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 Right here at the front. I mean, there's the entrance. Yeah. Immediately. The, the ornament. Why is Mario's butt? You like his butt? I wasn't facing that way. Oh, you don't like Mario's butt? No. Oh. Well, we've come once again into America's Best Toy Shop here on Black Friday with the original Squishmallows. Oh, that feels soft. Oh, Squishmallows are awesome. 
They're very squishy. They had some SeaWorld exclusive Squishmallows I saw the other day. Oh, did they? Yeah. You don't need no more Squish nothing. You got 417,000 Squish things. What's this? Uh, incinerator Trooper Carbonized. That thing is all jacked up. Wheel grief, like everywhere. Man, all those incinerator troopers have been through it. IG11. Huh. Baby Yoda puppet sticking your hand up as honey. No, that's new. Do they have any of the others? No. That's the new wave. They just have Tila. Oh. We'll just hold her. Hold her in the special way. Do they have Ajax? Oh, we're not to Marvel Legends yet. They have Cersei. Yeah. We need to Ajax. Uh, Tila. Eggy the Piggy. Cobra Enemy. Which one is that? A Trooper. Stalker. A Trooper. A Stalker. Iceman. Stance. Oh, nice. Ajax. Yeah, we need that one. Yeah. That's a big victory. What's happening? Ooh, doing something. Maybe he's cold. Just like start that. He's from the north. What about walking wiggle daisy? Do you think he shakes that thing? Yes. Here's Stance. Guy, did you look at the Ghostbuster? What's their podcast? No, these down here. The ones that are from the movie. Those ones. Whip them out. Show the good people. Winston. Who's that, Ray? Podcast. Guy has a crush on podcast. Podcast. Lucky. What do they build? Anything? They build the terror dog. Oh, 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 calamity. Do they have the main girl? Trevor. They don't have the main girl. Podcast Lucky P. Well, they're releasing a two pack that's a, a spoiler with the major moment from the movie oh. that she's in. So I think they released it later because it would be a spoiler. Look at all the G.I. Joe down here. Do they just have the single Ajax? Yeah. They have a million they have, Ajax? They have multiple Ajaxes. What's over here? Cobra Commander, Flint, and the Lady J, 100,000 of them. I think it's still going crazy, isn't it? Yeah. Is that because we're here? It sees our booty. It's eternal up there. There's a lot of... Marvel Legends. There's a lot of Marvel Legends. Hey, Jack. Magneto. Jolt. Kaya. The Beast Wars Megatron. Yeah? Man, there is a lot of them. That's good that we found the Ajax. And the Tila. And the Tila. And the other Masters would be good. I'm super squishy. Are <laughs> you hand me that Ajax? The one? I don't know. She looks good. That's the Walmart exclusive. No no build a figure piece. And a great big empty space where a build a figure piece would be. And Tila? Can I see Tila? Yeah, she looks good too. Okie dokie. Uh -huh. Get those. That's good. Lego. I got that Batman cowl. I don't think I've seen this before. Although, I think that's just three regular sets. And they put them all together. Walmart exclusive three in one. Unbelievable have seen that. Any other Lego stuff we need here? Don't believe so. Mopar Dodge. Is that new Batmobile? I do not think so. I do not think so. All right, Mecha Funko section. This Walmart doesn't really have a very big... Oh, they have Simpsons. Yeah, I want that. I do not want it for... Well, if it was two sixty nine, I want it. Two ninety nine, five twenty nine. dollars That thing rang up at two sixty nine. That's coming home, although we're not in my vehicle. And that's it. I don't think they have any other NECA stuff here at this Walmart. 
a fib was told they do have Nekka stuff. I didn't know it was here. And they have big, big Roshi. I and Kane. Big spawn clown. clown. That the one. battle armor Skeletor doesn't belong here. It's interesting. Ghostface. Big Michelangelo down there with... I don't know what he's got. Donuts? Yes, yeah, donuts. donuts. Notorious B.I.G. They have over there the Simpsons Arcade 1-Up. Oh, oh, oh. um, $529. Oh. Wasn't it like $750 or something? Yeah, if you buy it by the line because you have to get it shipped. Oh. All right, so where'd Kaya go? To the disco? I guess. All right, well. See you later. She heard the word trunks and she came running with a blush on her face. No, she won't even look at the camera, huh? just like when someone else is mentioned. <laughs> is it messy? No. <laughs> Sutton. Sutton. Again, nothing really feels like black rat. There's no, not a million there's people no here. Nothing seems to be on sale. Maybe it's just all online. I don't know. I, I haven't paid attention at all. But there is vinyl here. Vinyl. We're in the car. We're in the car because in addition to the items you saw, Reese's Potato Chips Big Cup. Everybody's trying it. Okay. Everybody's trying it. Sure. Kai wants to eat all of it. Reese's Potato Chips. Do chip. you think the potato chips will still be crispy? I don't know how that could be with the oils from the peanut butter. We're going to find out. Ooh, here's one for the back row. Got to take that lid off. Yep. Sorry, I'm, not not back paper. I'm not excited about it. Oh, it's lumpy on the top. Let me see. Ooh. That looks like some doo-doo. Is that what you said? Thick chocolate. Oh. All right. All right. Have a bite, Victoria. Oh. Natalie's going in. Let me just pinch off a snitch. Just a snitch. Oh, they're crispy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't know if I actually got potato chips. Huh. I'm not sure I taste the chip. It just adds like a crisp. Crunch. Almost like crunchy peanut butter. But without the peanuts. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, I have a lot of potato chips. Huh. Hmm. Let's see if we can see some tater chips in there. I don't like the pretzel ones. Mm, maybe you can see it there a little bit. Here. You like it, Victoria? It's your favorite? Yeah. I mean, it's no. not bad. It's just not my favorite. If it was, this if different. this it was a zero item and no other Reese's was, would you be eating this? Yeah. <laughs> it just adds a little salt. You can't really tell it's potato chips, though. Like, if you just gave it to someone and didn't tell them, they'd be like, there's something different, but I don't know what it is. Yeah. yeah. What do you think, Kyle? Kyle likes it. Oh, she's apparently taking off her shirt to eat it. I don't oh understand. Oh my goodness, hiding over. <laughs> I'm gonna keep the camera up here. Here. I'm good. Otherwise, it just tastes like a Reese cup. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Who asked for this? You. No, I mean. Oh, uh, what consumer? At a, at a corporate level, who said, you know what we need to do at mass production levels? Potato chips. Mm -hmm. Maybe the great potato farm shortage of 2020 where they had to throw things away led to this. <laughs> Maybe. Reese brought it up. Got a great deal. You got your shirt on. How'd you, how'd you like it? I mean, it's good. It's just a bit odd. I probably shouldn't be eating braces. Mm. Well, you eat lots of stuff you shouldn't eat with braces, like whoppers. <sighs> oh, wait. You mean like the candy? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Punishment. We've moved forward to a Target just for uh, what's popping. Maybe they'll look like they're, they're certainly a lot busier than the first two places that we went. So maybe they'll have some action, but no line to get in or anything like that. Maybe I just don't remember what Black Friday was like before COVID. I don't know. It sure seems like we had to wait in line all the time yeah. to get in the store, and there'd be like lines of TVs, and I guess everything online. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I know at Target I used to get 4K movies for like six bucks on Black Friday. That's how I get like my superhero ones. But I don't know. Is that just a sachet for the? Yeah, I'm really like Yeah. All right. The girls just abandoned me. We're right to Starbucks. We're right to Starbucks. Oh, pies. Well, that certainly looks like the Black Friday line now. 
That looks like it. Yep. Which means there's going to have to be something significant that I want here to wait in that big long line. Significant. And uh, I probably ain't going to happen. Glad I'm not looking for anything turtles related. Like back a few months ago, this would have been the time I found the turtles in disguise with a million people in line. But we'll see anyway. Well, they at least have Black Friday advertised prices. Lego stuff, but boy, there's been a lot of uh, pick through. That's not on sale. That's one I'd consider if it was on sale. What's this? Uh, TIE Fighter pilot helmet. A light bright. Uh, I guess everything comes back eventually. Let's see, that is not. We need a build deck to one we have actually. Shoes, more Lego. Lego have certainly been picked through pretty good. What's that? Uh, oh, the Queer Eye apartment. I don't think I've seen that yet. Oh, I see multiverse. Let's see. Any figures? Guys, we are on the figure aisle right now with Superman, Cabal, Cyborg, uh, Batwoman. Hmm. G.I. Joe, and Baroness, and Storm Shadow, and Baroness, and Snake Eyes, and Storm Shadow. Oh, they have an Akiko. Man, I need an extra one of her, but I do not want to wait in that line for that. 16, so 20 must be Scarlet. I do need an extra one of her. I need an extra one of her and an extra one of Scarlet. But, you know, I, uh, that line is bad. That line is bad. They are stocked full. From the Legends Crow, a million of those, a million Vulture, a million Hydra Stomper. I think that's buy one, get one half off. Marvel stuff. Oh, there's an Iceman. Iceman, who's that? A Cyclops. Man, they got a bunch of Cyclops. All those Eternals. Mobius. I don't know what any of that is. Nothing we need, nothing we need. Hmm. None of the new revelations of Faker. No AEW over there. Nerverse. Nothing that's gonna make me wait in this line yet. Let's go check out the NECA Funko section. As I've been talking about with all the TVs laid out in the way. All these TVs. Tracker strap, great for kids. I don't know what that is. That gentleman's very excited about the wing nut screw loose. Have you heard him say, you got to be kidding. That's because he just saw the wing nut screw loose. He must be excited for that. Uh, none of those are new. Demo Gorgon. Uh, same blue Vegeta. Bardock. Is that a Gotenks? Super, oh, Gogeta. I don't need any of those. They are very interested in that. If I was going to wait in line, I might would get this. Because I think that's pretty cool. It's like 30 bucks, maybe? And that's pretty doggone cool, actually. The Batmobile and the figures. I don't know that I'd get all of it, but the the Batcave, I feel like, could be used for pictures. be pretty cool. King Shark, everything but Polka Dot Man. Uh, Ultimate Spider-Man. Oh, another gunslinger. It's a cool figure. Dune guys back on there. And they do have ground shuck, wing nut and screw loose. The new frogs. What's that? Oh, Muck Man. I haven't seen Muck Man in a little while after there were a million of them. Probably Mondo Gecko hidden in here somewhere too. Is there a big chrome dome? Richard Simmons. All right. I don't think there's anything worth standing in the line for. Not this time. Sorry, Sophia. I lifted my beverage so you didn't park. I said safety. They got beverages. Well, I did gas not. gas fries, though? Yeah, she, yeah. she brought it in, so that's a good point. Uh, all right, anyway. No uh, purchases were made. It was too busy in there. But they did purchase uh, items. Now we'll go to the comic store. Our final stop in the Black Friday extravaganza, which has not been very extravagant, is uh, Top Dog Comics here. In their new location by the Fresh Market, which is a good location. Bigger, as I understand it. 
Let's see, maybe they have a Black Friday promotion. They do. Weekend sale, back issue, 25% off. Trade paperbacks, Marvel Legends, Transformers, McFarlane. All right, Hot Wheels. Wow. Good for him, that is way bigger. That's a sign, Pops. Lamar Jackson what? Oh, yes. I have one as well. Got the Iron Man wave. Did you say, come on, Negan? Thank you. Negan, Beta. Yeah, that's cool. Ding, 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 ding. Big pop. They have an 11 sign pop? Yeah. That's cool. Um, World Series champ stuff. Braves is one. All right, let's see if there's anything we want, Kai. Is there anything we want, Kai? What do you think? Is there going to be something we want here? What's your prediction? What's your prediction? Hey, man, how you doing? Hey, buddy. How you doing? Good. Fishing. I thought there might be Baby Yoda statue on the throne, on the seat. <laughs> yeah. Look how big this is. Oh, there's a Venom. You have that Venom. Oh, lots of legends. Red Ninja. Hmm. That's cool. I don't need that. I ordered that on Amazon. Oh, he may have the... No, I don't see the Scarlet and the Kiko here. I don't see any of the movie ones. Hmm. Big E Honda. Cobra Kai. Daenerys Targaryen and the Night King. I don't know what Kai is looking at. Transformers it. Are you looking at the shampoo bottle venom? Heard that. Oh, you're looking at the Doctor Strange SH figure arts and the Thor and the Gamora. Oh, no, I was looking at the best. The shampoo bottle venom? Yeah, I was seeing a shampoo bottle. It's, a, it's like the big kid's toy that looks like a big shampoo bottle. Oh. Yeah. Just shoeless in here? <laughs> shoeless Kyle? Well. Yeah, hot pants. Okay. Masterverse, not the new ones, though. Let's see. There's Kai again. DCUC. Dark side, McFarlane stuff. Ooh, look at that old Snake Mountain in Castle Grey Skull. That's cool. Ray Lewis. Mark Andrews. Man, are those are autographed. 225, 200. That's not a bad price at all. Thundercats. Uh, that's the Pixel Dam book. A bit. Victoria got me last year or for my birthday, maybe. I don't know, sing that song now, don't copyright me, YouTube. Hey, hey, YouTube. Look at these cases. Lego. Lego, Lego. That's the new Tumblr. That's cool. Dark Knight Rises. Let's see what's in the cases. DCUC. It's just kind of some random stuff. Oh, look at that. Autographed. The Toy Biz Sentinel. Hmm, $200 is not bad. Well, I don't know what that price is anymore, but it doesn't seem bad. Frost Giant, Giant Man. Hell, Terrax, it's going for a pretty penny right now. Robocop. And then this case had the, oh, there's an onslaught. This case had the she rod. Hmm, the bones. Wow, there's a lot of good stuff in here. Wrestling figures. This is the new Elite style packaging, I think. Yeah, Series 89. I think that's the first time I've seen that. Nia Jax. Jeff Hardy. Ultimates. Uh, I think we got all those. Celebrations collections. Dragapult Prime. I didn't think we got... We didn't get any of the Celebration stuff. We got the uh, Eevee set. I think that's the last Pokemon set stuff we've gotten. Viscera. Oh. Deluxe Headquarters. Oh, that's like the pop-up. That looks like the Optimus Prime. Those like cardboard ones. They're not bad. Little Guns and Roses on. And don't copyright me, Mesco. Yeah. Pandora 18, 4,000 plus arcade games. Plug into the TV and use this, this fight stick. Huh. Huh. 
Did you see the Batman statue? It's kind of like your turtles, where it's very um, like cartoon colored over there. I did not. I must have missed the whole section. Well, I didn't even walk back here with the comics. I got dis distracted. You can submit to get graded here, which is cool. Figures, figure graded. Oh, up there. That's old, too. Oh, yeah. That's super cool. Cell shaded. That's a figure. That's old. Huh. Big G.I. Joe vehicle. Time kill pain. Yeah, I just, like, completely didn't come to this section at all. Dark Phoenix, Loki, Spider-Man, it's all select. Yeah, it's a cool store. This is always had a cool store. Three and three quarter stuff, the vintage card, Kingpin. My, no, he may actually have some legends that we could use that we're missing. Like that Mysterio right there, as a matter of fact. Uh, we need that for the MCU collection. Because I don't have that for some reason. That's good. I'm actually going to look at the list. A few others that we're missing. He's not going to have the T'Challa build of it. Well, he may have it, but he'll be sitting right here. Maybe T'Chaka. Oh, that Nick Fury I kind of need. Hmm. Let me just look through here. One moment. Need that crossbones, too. Probably gonna pick that up. And the Talos, Nick Fury, Mysterio. The most of the ones were missing, so that's good. Some of the stuff back there. Of course, the frame is strong outside. <laughs> Overcome, signed okay. helmets, a bunch of Mezco, Michael Jordan. Look at that. Yeah, that's good too. Anything. Lots of signed stuff. Lots of Braves. Oh, Pokemon. See, we didn't get that. We have Chilling Rain. We have all three of those. We don't have that. More slabs back there. That's some cool art. The Joe Fest convention that you saw us go to a few months ago there. The big sponsor of that. Been shopping here for many years. Just this is our first time in this location, and it's great. They're on a lot of Black Series, actually. Shore Troopers. Jackie Chan. Jackie Chan. And we got some more Star Trek stuff. I don't see that as often. Some articulated icons, ninjas. I'm about everything in here. Grand Old Opry Rising Star Barbie. Hmm. Alien, Tomb Raider. Well, a lot of Barbie. Did you look at all the Barbies, Natalie? Barbie loves Frank Sinatra. Birthday party Barbie. They're in the pop section. They're popping it up. Are you buying these yourself? Or are you trying to get me to buy them? I think I'll, I'll buy the Gwen Pools. And then uh, the $6 one and the $25 one you're trying no, to get me to buy? I'm just wanting to show you guys. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I need to buy it. Well, no need to buy it, huh? That's why it's just in the hand. I guess mom. I showed it to mom and mom was like, I don't know. I don't know what mom's doing. Hopefully she's putting it back or taking it out of allowance. Thundar, the barbarian. Do you see all the different Michelle's? Uh, I haven't bought Walking Dead Pops in a long time, but no, I didn't realize they had that many. They've got so many different, different ones. Mm -hmm. I had that one. That one may be, that one looks old, actually. 15 bucks? Hmm. Black and white Daryl. That's kind of cool. I know what you're, yeah. They have a lot of Walking Dead Pops. I haven't bought Pops in a long time, other than the occasional one, like Krang, you know, like Krang. You got glitter on your eyes, I see. There's some Simpsons. Look at everything in here. Gundam. Gundam. Spawn. Old Spawn, too. Old Spawn. Hey, oh, Vitruvian Hacks, even. Oh, and Legions. Huh. Oh, I got that horse. That horse is cool. And the Devil Guy. Man. I did not know they carried Legions and Hacks. Good for him. That's nice. That's a good shop. Good shop. Lots of uh, role play stuff. And then comic supplies. All right. We got to figure out what we're buying. I am going to get those MCU Legends for Kai's collection, and I'm sure we'll end up with some pops. Oh, my hero. Dragon Stars. Is that, that Gogeta that was the Walgreens exclusive movie? Got those villains. 
Huh. Super 7 Rock Steady, Mikey, April. There's the shippers behind them, yep. What's this? Some sort of splinter. Joe vehicles in the Detolfs. Hmm. All right, let us figure out what we're going to get. We got to get out of here. Kyle, do you have a sack? I do. I do too. And Adley has two sacks. We finally Black Friday shop. Three sacks. Your eyes on this sack of purchased merchandise. Of a hell horse and a hell guy. Mm -hmm. Kai got some trade paperbacks. I'm excited. She gets to read books, read comics. Got a lot of stuff. That was good. I'm glad we went in there. That's a tremendous store. Top Dog Comics. www.topdogcomics.com. Just exactly the way regular words are spelled. Uh, check them out. And if you're ever in the uh, this area of East Georgia, come see them. And they're at Joe Fest. He just said Jason David Frank. He said once a month they're going to try to have autographs here. That's cool. That is cool. That is cool. All right, we're going to go catch up with mom and dad and figure out some more action package. Oh. Fast forward. We are now at, well, that doesn't show you where we're at. Oh, Charlie's for dinner because Natalie wants baked potato soup. She wants to dip rolls in it over and over and over again. Is that correct? Yes, I do. Yes. That's what she wants to do. And Kaya said, what's an O Charlie's? <laughs> right, yeah. You guys got food and everything is in and all y'all okay? I think we're great. Able to spin his dick right. Thank you. Yay, thank you. Wow. Oh, you guys yeah. think you're going to do anything? I'll do that chick on Dr. Rob, okay? Oh my goodness yeah. gracious. Mm -hmm. That's just amen and in the mouth. <laughs> you made yeah. the legitimate Tigger. <laughs> like that, that sound the Tigger makes. That's good. It's so yummy. The wonderful thing about Tiggers is baked potato soup. Ron, you used to love it, didn't you? Oh, I, I have it myself. <laughs> yes. I'm not going to lie. It's, it's, I got that for y'all. I thought Victoria might want some spinach dip. Don't you like spinach dip? Yes. I got a steak. What'd you get, Nashville hot chicken sauce? Uh, I, I thought that this That's, I see. I see Nashville hot sauce. I, I'm not a hot, hot chicken. You got to try it. No. You going to rib it up? Yeah. Mom's eyeballing I'm them ribs. I see her. She's over there going to eyeball them. She's going to take them. I, I'm not a... a I guess Natalie just got nothing and didn't fled. No. Oh, the chop steak. Are you going to steal your mom's hot chop steak? No. Oh, that's nice. Oh, onions. Mmm. All right. I'll just try just a teeny tiny bit of hot Nashville hot chicken. Look, hot chicken. It's hot chicken, Nashville hot chicken. It's just a teeny tiny bit. It's a lot of a bit. It's a, what? It's a teeny tiny bit. One, two, three, go. Yeah, it's delicious. It's See? Yeah, it's delicious. Mm-hmm. I can't wait to eat some Nashville hot chicken. Delicious, yes? Oh, oh you don't like it. No. Mm. Oh, well. Chopstick for Natalie. Mm -hmm. Victoria's so demanding oh. that Kai has a crush on Draco Malfoy over there, it sounds like. <laughs> we're swinging by second and Charles because ours near us is closed. So we're going to see if they have anything we're looking for. We're done with our uh, oh, yeah. items. Look at that. That's just demanding you'll have a crush on Draco. <laughs> That's because Slytherin is best, yes? I mean. It's the Blu-ray Casino. That's the Blu-ray. Man, if Seth and Mike were with us, we'd be doing it. I mean, that's a lot in there, too. 50 for $30. Oh, Joe Exotic, Tiger King, the tell-all memoir. That's kind of is hefty. it by him, though? Is it? I don't know. Written from prison? From the preface. That doesn't help either. I don't, I don't see who the author is. Um, still no. I don't well, I mean, know. is that... Are they... I mean, I guess if it's considered a memoir... Yeah, I think maybe it's about I guess him. it maybe it is. Written in, and that's why it only says Joe's. Oh. Joe's oh. Auto. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It just comes out. It's definitely by him. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Oh. Never. <laughs> Never. Let's see, they got a case at the front. Spawn the violator. Oh, there's nothing in there. Case worthy. I don't really think. No. Not really. You know, it's just kind of random. It's a good place to find pops, though. They always have one million pops. Holly Short. I don't know what that is. Harry Potter. Uh, boy, they have a lot. Lots of Funko pops. 
Why food great? Dilbert, Raphael. Specifically, what I'd like to look for here is some more trades for Kaya. Ang, Ang, I think we have all of those. PS4, Nintendo Switch. Probably nothing we need in that. Uh, back there should be toy. Yeah, toys are back there. Although there's many things. Kaya's just on the hunt. She's just walking around on the hunt. She's excited. This is the Ray Parker Jr. Probably popular at the moment. Hmm? Maybe not. Let's see what we got. Man, lots of vinyl. I think last time I came in here, there was no vinyl. Shows how quickly that category has grown again. Board game Bonanza, all right. McFarlane. This is like regular release stuff. Marvel Legends. And there's a Talos. I did bought a Talos. Oh, 11 dollars Wow, that would have been a cheap one. Wenwu, Union's Vale. Uh, I have got significant flatulence. Just letting it, letting it out, absorbing man, oh, absorbing man wave safety. Oh, of course. Oh, safety. All right, comics and trades is what I'm gonna look for specifically. I just wanna show you any other stuff. Oh, holiday deals. Buy one, get one free action figures. Huh. Well, Hush, Catwoman, Mayf that's a Mafex, I think. Metacom, like, not Mafex, but Metacom's real action heroes. There's Six Scale, all those old Ghostbusters. Street Fighter, Cyclops, Karate Kid. Who makes this figure? Icon Heroes. I think somebody was asking about that line at some point. Pirates of the Caribbean. Oh, select thing. Hmm. Pixel Pals. Big, big predator. Why? Oh, dynamic action heroes. Oh, man. Beast Kingdom exclusive. Huh. Did you see the 100 CDs Wait, no. history boxes? No, really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at Boo. I like that boo. He looks happy. He looks very happy. What about this Carol Baskin? <laughs> oh my. Victoria. <laughs> Where's Victoria? She may want that item. You think she wants think? that? Just hold it. Okay. I mean, no. I know she doesn't want it, but we're sure going to show it to her. Is that in a thousand toys, Hellboy? No. It's a little one of those things. Huh. It's up here on the front. Pimp Death's Row. It's a mystery box of 100 music CDs. Oof. How much does that thing cost? I don't know. I think it's like 30 bucks. That's just a no loot bomb. Girl! <laughs> Natalie's going to go deliver it to her. Let's check it out from afar. You don't want that? No. Did you look closely at it? Brian says You don't want to recreate that? With who? I don't know. Pick someone. Hi, Kaya. I thought that was cacaos for me. Oh, no. That's, I mean, it was just for all, all cacaos. Did you find anything you're looking for? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Pop the pig. All right. She got a Venom. Donnie Kate's Venom number one. I got her. Which I think she's old enough to read. I'll have to do a little pre- I want to see if they have more. Avengers, Avengers, Avengers. Thor. Astonishing Thor. All right. X-Men. Uh, all right. Vampire Venom. There is not many. And neither of those are Donny Cates. Is there more venom down here? Nope, vision. Those must be popular because they're not even in stock on Amazon either. Oh well. Alright. I don't know that we're gonna get anything here, but let me look around closer. 
no venom, but I'm gonna pick up a couple silk and a spectacular Spider-Man. See if she likes those. Boo! I actually grabbed a few more. Found some others that I like. I think she liked. So Miss Marvel, and they got these four box. So they have the first five of those. I think these are the first five. Although the yeah yeah. And then the first Moon Girl Devil Dinosaur, the first Kate Hawkeye, and the first She-Hulk. Since a lot of these are becoming series, I thought it'd be good to get her the trade, and they're so cheap. And they're buy five, get five free, so super cheap. Now I gotta try to s sneak and check out without her seeing these. They're back there somewhere, so I think I can do it. Look at that big stormtrooper. Big trooper. I do see this. We found this, and we're gonna get this. I like... It's her little, Gretzka's little buddy that goes. Let's see, the, oh, there's the other one. Those are cute. They're cute, oh, that one has a karaoke machine. Get that for Kaya, she'll like that. I was thinking we could buy that mystery box with the boys and we have to watch all the movies at Castle Dub. In fact, I'm gonna get on Instagram and challenge them. They're gonna say no. This is, it's like, it, oh, okay. What's that? It's paper? <laughs> If it's we fast forwarded. I don't know what all we've been. Mom and Dad's be pie. We talked to Kai about football because she has a crush on a football player. Ooh. And uh, now we're about to drop Victoria off and head back to Atlanta. So fare thee well, Victoria. Thank you for hosting us for Thanksgiving. Yes, thank you for coming. And uh, we'll see you pretty soon to go to Sea World. Yeah. Maybe maybe ahead of that. I don't know, but definitely in a couple weeks. I guess that's just three weeks away. Mm -hmm. I yeah, think. Like that, yeah. yeah. Yep. Lots of cakes and pies. And we're going to drive Hot home. Chocolate. Hot chocolate. We will pick this up tomorrow where Kai and I are going to go on some sort of adventure. Okay. Okay. That sounds fun. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> oh, safety. Oh, no. I'm behind. I get to get out of the vehicle. <laughs> Kaya. Yes. Why didn't you ask the truck driver the student creed and he didn't know it? Why did that happen? I'm, I'm sorry. He now didn't you're gonna have to owe me an extra dollar. On top of that, you gotta tell Baby Yoda the student creed. Right. He's ready. Okay. I intend to develop myself in a positive manner and avoid anything that will impair my mental growth or physical health. I also intend to develop myself with self discipline in order to bring out the best in myself and others. And finally, I intend to use the skills I learned in class constructively and defensively to help myself and my fellow man and never be abusive or defensive. Offensive. Baby Yoda, do you think that's gonna count this time? Please, Baby Yoda. Hmm, Look at that grin. Safety! Oh, Baby Yoda, did you pass gas? That's Kaya that poots on the hashtag, not Baby Yoda. Next morning, I'm back home. I need to have a protein shake and a monster this morning. This is the package that we'll look at later. Um, I don't think I showed you this. So Natalie snuck away the day after we saw Ghostbusters, went back to the theater we saw it at and picked that up for me. How sweet of her. The uh, Ecto-1 replica, the popcorn tin hub. So uh, we'll probably open that up in this video as well. Uh, it's very cool. It's very cool. Excited to open that up. Then the things we picked up from uh, Top Dog. There's the uh, the horse. Myth of Legions, what's his name? Atheon, Athon. And then the demon dude, Arether, Arether, Arether. Oh my. Picked up those two guys. And then the legends you saw us pick up. That'll go in the Legends case, which uh, has already had a tumultuous fall, but we'll deal with that. So just a, a rehash. And then we had the other Master Universe figures. I don't know where I put those. Um, but uh, there's all of that. that we'll, I don't know that we'll look at all of this in this video, but we'll definitely open this box up and look at this guy. And I don't know about the rest. I don't know. I haven't decided yet, but I'm going to start my morning with a trip to kickboxing. Blueberries and cream equate high performance protein shit. Uh, and then I'll grab Kaya and she and I will uh, go on an adventure. Um, Natalie unfortunately has to work today. She owns her own business, uh, which, whether I don't, know, I don't know if I've said that or not, but she owns her own business. 
And thus that gives her a lot of flexibility, but the downside of owning your own business is you don't get paid time off. Like a lot of people don't get paid time off. So on weeks like this, where we went to SeaWorld and we had the holidays, she just has to move her work around. So she has to work all day today, which stinks. Now I feel bad. I wish she didn't have to. Um, but it did enable us to be able to go on the holiday. So I appreciate that. Thank you, babe. Uh, so she's got to work all day. So I'll have Kaya today and we're going to run around, find some things to get into and kind of wrap up this video, uh, this episode of Dub Life, which uh, has turned into a lot more toys than I thought it would at the beginning. So hopefully you've enjoyed that, but I'm going to get kickboxing. Uh, I do need to swing by the storage unit and, and drop off from hiding Christmas presents. Some of the stuff we bought yesterday that I don't want Kaya to see. And, uh, soon we need to wrap Christmas presents. We need to get a tree up, wrap Christmas presents. So I bought a lot and, uh, I don't know what all I bought. So I may be done Christmas shopping. I got to figure it out. Anyway, off the kickboxing. Talk to you after. Done with workout. That's several hours later. I have Kaya somewhere. Where's Kaya? Oh, hi. Where are you? I was looking. There she is rocking her Jordans. Uh, yeah, you didn't look at what we got. We got, well, you saw, hold on. You didn't even see us get. We got a Nick Fury and the Tells and a Mysterio and Cross Moans. Those look really and cool. Ajax. We should open this up before we leave, don't you think? See what's inside? Sure, I don't know what's inside. I'm excited to find out what's inside. Well, let's find out. Extra large in the packaging. Well, that's just talking about me. You know. Yeah, probably. It's kind of hard to do. Oh, Calamity Kaya. All right. Is that exciting? Yes, it is exciting. That is not very good packaging. Let me get these stuck through there. But let's see. Oh, just all this stuff just thrown in there. So it comes with the t shirt. Is the t shirt cool? Oh, the t shirt actually is cool. That is cool. Huh. It's all kind of weird characters. It comes with a pen. Channel 6 News pen. Maybe I should start letting you use these turtle pens. April O'Neil Press Pass, which is much nicer than the Press Pass that they had her sign. This not is, exclusive. It's, it's, the, it's a patch. You can a patch. Like Channel 6 patch. Yeah. Poster. Should I open the Sure. Poster? I have no idea what's in it. <laughs> You just gotta roll it back up. Oh. All right. I don't think I'm making progress. Huh. And then this, this yeah, big well, set here. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do this. Catwoman yeah. from Channel 6. Hopefully, this has some sort of window. Uh oh. Maybe there's a package at the door. Maybe it doesn't have a window opening. Maybe it just slides off. Maybe it slides. Yeah, it slides off. Oh, I think it's the background for pictures. Is that what it is? All right, that slides off. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just like Oh, it is just like the Channel 6 backdrop yeah. poster. Happy. Happy hour, April. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Should I go see what, if, what's at the door? Uh, sure. Does this have a window? Oh, there it is. There's the window. It's got the four. Oh, this look really cool, actually. April with the cat. And they're Vernon. See, if you could have got two, I would have done both Irmos. Well, that would have been way expensive, and you can only open one. All right. That's cool. Happy with it. Basically, all the packages were Christmas presents. I can't show them. Except for this. Some new kickboxing shorts that I'm interested to try out. I'm trying to find some that are MMA style. Um, that I don't have to wear shorts over the top and don't show the package. You know, so. Got a new pair to try out. Yep. On we go, lunchtime. All right, we got lunch date time at Pat Eatery. Hey. Kaya wants a Reuben sandwich. So we're coming for a Reuben sandwich. All right, Pat's Eatery, salads, soups, much different than the all you can eat brunch that we can get. We're gonna get some melts, I think. Oh, baby. I got a pastrami Reuben and tomato soup. Kaya got a corned beef Reuben and coleslaw, and we got some Frenchie fries. Are you excited? I am very excited. Oh, 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 yeah, 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 that's right. Uh. Do the Victoria. Please. Do the Victoria, yes. I is going in for her Reuben. See if it's uh, everything that she has in her mind that it's going to be. Oh, look, it's steamy. Okay. Yeah. Go in with it. 
I got soup ready. Oh, hot, hot. Yeah, well, it was steaming. Delicious? Yeah, I think she said, burst and murmur. All right, we're gonna eat lunch. We'll talk to you after. Well, Kaya ordered Milky Way cake. Is that exciting? Yes. Oh. Kaya finished her cake. It's four o'clock. We've been taking our sweet time on our date day. But now we're finally here at Second Chance Collectibles. We're looking for some, uh, maybe some MCU legends, if they have a few that we're missing. Honestly, we're just hanging out. I hear pigeons or something. You hear that? <laughs> oh, oh, oh! I was like, where are the pigeons? Oh, there. They're up there. With the flying V. I don't think those are pigeons. I think that's, uh... Huh. I bet that's coming through on... I hope y'all can hear that. Wow. Let's see. We got lots of MCU legends down there. Hawkeye. Old crossbones. Lots of everything legends. Oh, is that John Carter, Captain America? Kai's favorite? Drax? Your favorite, right? The real Captain America, you say? see that. Down there. He's hidden back down there somewhere. No. No? Not the favorite. No, not the favorite. Uh, oh, there's a worthy cap back there. Taskmaster. Oh, that's an old one there. That's the what, Red Goblin. That was a toy box. That guy's still up there. What's up top? Ant-Man, Wolverine. Ding dong. <laughs> That's right. Grandmaster, I need the collector. It's a hard one to find. I don't think we need any of those guys. Crossbone, lots of crossbones. Uh, no. Mr. Sinister. <laughs> that must be a select. Magneto. Let's see, DC. Is that Ares? Build a figure. There are some sealed legends back there. Let's see if there's a T'Chaka. The few that we need are just kind of obscure. They're not even necessarily expensive, they're just random. What's going on, man? Ebony Maw. Mordo, Cloak and Dagger, Paladin. <laughs> I don't know, I've lost Kaya. Maybe she went to the anime section. I've lost her. Look at all these sideshow. Six scale. And the Hot Toys Star Wars figures. My goodness. That is a lot. You're just weeping for Orko. Is there an Orko in here? I, I haven't ever seen, I haven't seen There's definitely an orco camera. like this. Oh, orcos. There's only been a few. And they're usually more. pretty popular or hard to find. There, there's going to be one. Some, uh, hmm. turtle stuff, gargoyles. Old gargoyles. I have bots over there. I skipped that case. Oh, Super Saiyan Vegeta. Old school Dragon Ball GT figure. That's an old, old figure. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. You like it that he's almost shirtless? Some of these in package. It's a great store. Second chance. Definitely come. We love these guys. I gotta look around and find what I want, though. We gotta find what I want, Kai. What are we? What are we gonna get here? What are we gonna get? We have to go in the back. Oh, Centurions. I've got the ramen toy Centurions coming in. Oh, those are hard to find. The villains. There's Thundercats. I haven't seen Thundercats yet. No, we haven't watched any Thunder and Silverhawks. Monstar. We haven't watched any of that yet. Air Raiders. Spawn. Uh, is there a Gandalf? There's a Gandalf. Warriors of Virtue Elysia. Yeah. No. I said, oh. Star Wars. Star Trek, M5 Stewart Tank. All right, and of course the wrestling. 
I need to post this on a You're gram. Too much, man. For Sethy. Wow, my football monster. We're in the back room again. I, I, I have no idea. Two hundred. Yeah, it's all. It's a vintage. Oh, here's a bunch of prints. We're in the back. We're in the back, Kyle. Looking in the back. Looking in the back. There's an Optimus Prime. Well, that's a big, like, die cast. That is heavy. That is a big die cast Optimus Prime. Megatron. It's also big. I wonder if that's a masterpiece. Pretty good looking. Heart bin? I, I don't... don't know. Don't know. Oh, this is not what you're looking for, is it? It's not. It's not your. Not your specific area. Let's see what's over here. Oh, oh. Right. Oopsies. Oh, turtles. Look, turtles. Turtles. Lots of turtles. Bebop with the tail. Got a Sammy Guevara. Darby Allen finger skateboard. I think that was out of like a loot crate. Here's a pillow. <laughs> Is that the... Oh. Do you like that Lots of wrestlers. Where's it, Raphael? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm, that's a thing I possibly could have had in my life. That is possible. Let's see what's over here. This is where sometimes Marvel Legends are. Oh, there's Star Wars. They're opening up this area permanently soon. There's a Nightcrawler. There's Spider-Man. Oh, here's uh, this guy. Sugar Man. Uh, Hulk Buster. There's Hulk There's all kind of stuff. I'm going to have to do a quick little dig. Quick little dig. Uh, Kaya has found a Sandman. Mr. Sandman. That's a select Sandman. It's got all these different pieces. And a movie. Lizard. I don't know who made that. Can't find anything on the butt. There's stuff on the foot. Is there stuff on the foot? Know what that says? I don't know. And then I think this is a select carnage. Also, those are all kind of cool. DST. Diamond select. Don't safety. Not. Tie goes to the safety. I'd be in trouble because there's not a. Huh. There are no doors. Nope. Doesn't smell good though. I. Don't there's a lot of good good. stuff in there. There was an apocalypse down there. There's a lot of good stuff. Look at all these build a figure pieces. Just a huge box of build a figure pieces. What's oh? That doll? <laughs> Baby brass. Look at those horsies. My life as a horse. There's that Hulk uh, toy box. What's this? Jurassic Park 3 display. The G.I. Joe vintage room. Terror drone. Oh, I don't know what that thing is. Oh, visionaries. Wow. Look at that. On the card. Man. So much good stuff, Sky Striker. So this is the new room that they're getting set up. Did you come in here because it had this uh, yeah. legacy that word? This one? Is that why you decided to come in here to that thing? What are you pointing at? I'm sorry. Oh, uh, the Red Ranger helmet. Oh. Look at all this stuff. Power Rangers, all these, uh, I didn't even know what. Various bots. Oh, look, there's a Dragon Ball section. I did look at the Dragon Ball. And a, a Hunter Hunter. A bunch of Gokus. Hunter Hunter. There's one Hunter Hunter. Like, there's a Boo. Oh, there's a Boo. And a Frieza and a Cell. Oh, Android. it's a I think that's the figure art Cell in the pod, maybe? Or is that a model? I don't know. What's the old Goku? The, 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 the one that's cell. in the pod. The, uh, the Frieza in the cell. Not... What, the Frieza the Oh, the Hunter Hunter. Yeah. That is $250 Figma. Yeah. Wow. Expensive taste. So this area, they'll have open up, uh, I think he said as early as Monday. In a few days. Showroom full. They're expanding and they already have a huge space. That's awesome. Good for them. All right. We got to figure out what we're going to get. We got to figure out what we're going to get. Quite a bit of Simpsons toys. These are Playmates, I think. These, these actually look good. Casual Homer and his draws. There's a lot of Simpsons here. I know people really like that line. 
Oh, looks like maybe some more over there. And there's My Little Pony. All these board games, along with the electric command compound Jurassic Park. But there's these board games, which includes cooties. What are you putting on? Oh, oh. Okay. And there's Smack It. Are you about to have a catch? <laughs> no. I just wanted to put it on. Hold it aloft like Zelda. Hold it aloft. Yes. Okay. All these G.I. Joes by year in the drawer. And Kaya's Jordans as well. That is cool. Wonder what happened here. Oh, my. Python Patrol Trooper. I don't think they have many classified. That thermos right there. That turtle's thermos. That is awesome. Luminicans. I don't know what you're talking about. Animatics. Animatics. Animaniacs? Animaniacs. Okay. <laughs> Look at all these vehicles. All these G.I. Joe vehicles. Sky Striker. Look at all of them. All this goodness. Hmm. Tomahawk, would you fly that helicopter? Yeah, I would crash. Yeah, that's the truth. <laughs> Maybe the day, Kaya. To finally own these guys. Kaya! Do you have a sound? I do. I also have a sack. Thanks to Chance and his dad, we had another wonderful visit to Second Chance Toys. We'll show you what we picked up. Well, actually, we'll tell you because we probably won't still be filming when we get home. I got the four NECA turtles. Kaya got the carnage and the lizard and the sandman. Sand sand. That's exciting. So now we're going to go to Plastic Empire and keep looking for uh, goods. Or Plastic Empire. Kaya wants pops. Maybe. Maybe. Did you bring your monies? I did. Ooh. Look at all those amiibo. Hmm. We have them. Big, big pops. Hey, yeah. I believe I would get these because my big bad toy store pre-order hasn't come in. They're the same price and they're 15% off for small business day. What's that? What are the ones that mom's told me as far as the avatar pops go? Oh, I have to look. Oh, they got the big Donatello too. I can do the same thing with that. This big bad toy store is taking forever on these. Yeah. And they get that guy too. The evil Majin Buu. You want the evil Majin Buu? Yeah. Uh, yeah. We're getting yeah. both of these. Yes. Uh, yes. 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 In the meantime, yeah, so. massive yeah. ball of pops. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Cobra Hiss. Lots yeah. of stuff. Yeah. Lots of stuff to look for here. Where's. Yeah, oh, these avatar. Yeah, I think she has all those. I will look. I will look. Lots of figures. New G.I. Joe that I need. Oh, Red Ninja. <laughs> need that Scarlet. And the Redecos. Uh, do they have the new Master Verse? Tila? So it's possible. Tila. And those all Skeletor. He Man. Tila. Evil Lin. Doesn't look like anymore. <laughs> what figure are you looking at that's making you say you don't need any more figures? Oh, two baskets. Two baskets and this video. Oh. Some figures behind the cases. Some Sailor Moon, but. Natalie has all of those. Do you see Avatar ones behind the case? No. Crack, fat gum. Fat gum. Could have got that sign the other day. Oh, not that you see crack. Well, I have those. Hmm? Yeah, well, I don't either. Boo Hollow Twisted Treats. You like that all night? Oh, look. The cute suit. Yeah. Got all these signed paws. Lots of signs. But Mary, that is cool. Kaya's gonna get that for herself, and these are some things for her friends for Christmas. Right over here are some Christmas presents for Natalie, so we're not gonna show those. Nope. No. I think we're gonna get Sue too. She's my favorite of the ladies, and the Van Presto is very expensive, so we'll get this. More Centurions with the box. That is cool. 
Harry Potter stuff. I think signed by Stanley, the collector core. All right. We got a big pile of stuff. We got to get on out of here. Got to get on out of here. What is that? Oh, the fighting armor. Big Batman. Oh, dear. I think that's the Comic-Con Scareglow revelation figure. Oh, dear. And the Sergeant Slaughter. I shouldn't even have looked in these cases. I should have just ran away. Ooh. Well, that was an eventful stop, yeah? yeah? We got a lot of stuff. We are gonna have to show you everything we bought when we get home, because now Except there's for enough. Christmas presents Except for Christmas presents for mom. Uh, Kaya got the Christmas present for her friends, Secret Santa, all that kind of stuff, yeah. right? I think we're gonna go to Steel Collectibles. One more stop while we're over here on this part of town. Oh, safety! Oh no. I am too. Kaya donated $25 to the St. Jude's Children's Hospital at the last store. Steel Collectibles. That's our final stop. We have about 30 minutes we can shop here. Let's see what we're working with. A lot of legends. Well, they have Tachaka. Looks like these are all newer. Probably won't have that. They may have them loose, though. Yeah, these have loose stuff here. Up there. That's an old set. That Thor. Let's see if Kai's looking at the comics. Looking at the comics. Oh, the Link's Awakening poster is what you're looking at. That's up there. Get the case. Loose case. Is there an Umbaku build a figure? Or Tachaka. I don't see either of those. Nope. Look at all those Dragon Ball. All these Boo. Huh. Goku, Black, Rose. Yes. I do not see anything we need there. Big Yoshi. Big Yoshi. Rescue. Nobody wants that holographic Iron Man. Oh, G.I. Joe. Let's see. Read the sign. Oh, I can't think that's, that's probably COVID. I think 20 is the number I need. It's like every, oh, this may be the Reed Deco. I may need that, actually. Everybody has, but no Akiko. That's so interesting. 15. I think I do need that Scarlet. I think that's the, the Reed Deco one. Need that one in the box. That's good. Big, big, big Sully. Let's wild lens it. Big Sully with a porg. That is the redecoed roadblock. I need also. Good. By need, I mean I don't have a sealed version of it. I have a loose version of it, but the redecos, I don't have a sealed. So I'm trying to have a boxed or a sealed and a loose of all of them because I'm crazy. But these are some of the few. I need Arctic Storm Shadow. I need the Duke redeco. I need the Regal Cobra Commander. And I think that's it. And I'll have a box and sealed of all of them. Stupid Brian. A lot of comics. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a game. Turtle stuff up there. Just various. Lots of various things. Oh, look at all those systems right there. Because they do. They have a lot of video games. Oh, some Super 7 Turtles. I gotta work my way by there. Look at the uh, Jump Force. It's the day after. And the and Turtles. And oh, the Batman. And then look at the seal. What? I don't know if it's sealed. Probably not sealed. Uh, in box. Legend of Zelda. That's cool. Oh. Excuse me? Yes. Yeah, things. Have, uh, Upgraded suit Spider-Man. Tony Stark. Some Mezco. Frost Giant. Giant Man. Sonic Advance for which? That's what's up there. Turtles, hmm? Pikachu. Yeah. That is what that is. Amiibo, uh, Piranha Plant, a whole bunch of games. Let's see, and then all these pops we gotta look through. All right, we, they're about to close, so I'm gonna move quickly and get out of here. I don't think I've ever seen that pop, the Purunga. The thick Shinron. Beefy Shinron, that's right. Kai's gonna get this plush pillow. I'm gonna get these Joes, and maybe it. Not that we haven't spent enough money today. They do have two amiibo we don't have, but I don't know if there's any sale right now. I'll have to ask. Oh, 
poopy. Aww. Ty's digging for the stickers. Five for five dollar stickers. A little bit of Oh, package. I forgot to take my kickboxing bag out of the car at the beginning of the morning. So right now it smells like kickboxing gloves and flatulence. But we got a pillow, got those G.I. Joe figures, got some stickers. We gotta drive all the way back home now. So we'll show you everything when we get home and see what mom's doing. Minus mom's stuff. Yeah, that's prizes. We're back home. I got some fries and a sandwich. Kai has ice cream and fries. Did you eat corn dog? I did. Natalie has burgers mm -hmm. and, and curds. Mm -hmm. And let me quickly show you everything we got. So Kai got this carnage and this lizard and that Sandman. Of course, they had all kind of pieces with them. There, we got the big four, the big purchase for turtles. That's all from Second Chance. I already showed you all that stuff from earlier. Then at Steel, we got the Swamp and those two Joes. And then from Plastic Empire, we got the Sergeant Slaughter, the Scare Glow, Videl, Big Turtles, Pirates, Sue, and Natsu. Very, very exciting. In fact, let me open up these two guys and show you them real quick. So the Sarge, it's got the Cobra Clutch on the tab. Looks great in the packaging. Got the backdrop. Old OG in style. That's very cool. And then this guy is just tremendously cool. So he's got his own shipper box. And then he's got a slip cover. If I can do this out one-handed. Oh, we're going to get close. Getting close to it. Let's see. If I can get it out. There we go. There we go. Sliding it. Slide, slide. Slip and slide. Something like that, right? How's the culprits over there, ladies? It's delicious. Oh, so then and open this thing up. And my goodness, that is awesome. It's got the light as it glows in the dark. It's so cool. So cool. It's on the back. Ooh, that's neat. Yay. But that wraps up this episode of Dub Life. Isn't that right, Kaya? Yep. Did you have fun on the adventure and all the okay. various things we did over Thanksgiving? There's Natalie. She's having foods. Mm -hmm. Well, we've got a lot of toys to open again. I don't know if that'll be on camera or off camera, but uh, we still have tonight. We're going to watch Amazing Spider-Man 2. Woohoo! Yeah. And then tomorrow, I don't know what we're going to do. We might watch Star Wars. We might start our Star Wars journey. Mm -hmm. And some Daredevil. I don't know. We'll find out together. Mm -hmm. Till then, I'm going to steal a French fry. And you know what I'm going to do? Well, I'm going to bite it. it. You're going to put it in the mouth. I'm going to put it in the mouth. But, but first, you're going to squeeze it. Woo!